I just want to show y'all. I'm so ahead of schedule now because of the the cancel um, lures and everything. Look, it's it's one fourteen a.m. I'm not even supposed to get here. <laughs> They say I'm supposed to be there at 6.40. Man, I'm about to get there so early, bro. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What's up, YouTube, man? It's your boy, Tay Wilson. I'm back with it again. Hopefully, everybody having a blessed day, blessed night, whatever you want to call it. Um, so, as you can see, I just showed y'all pulled into the yard. Um, I just knocked out my pre-trip. Today, I got about six stops. I'm doing about 372 miles today. I'm going from uh, Baltimore, starting in Baltimore, going to Delaware, then going out New Jersey. I think I got like, yes, I'm doing, I'm starting at Baltimore. Then I'm going to Delaware, New Jersey, another spot in New Jersey, back to uh, Baltimore, and then I got another stop in Baltimore after that. So I got a total of six stops today, 372 miles. Yeah, so let's get to it, man. Um, you know, this video not going to be a whole, like a whole, if y'all seen my last video, uh, I did a day in the life of an Amazon truck driver before where I recorded from the moment the whole shift to the end if you didn't see that i'll put that link in uh, my description so y'all can check that out this is just gonna be like a cool little vlog i'm not gonna record the whole time i'm just gonna you know i don't know i'm gonna just record some of my stuff throughout the day um i got 14 hour shifts like i said i started at 12 i'm not due to get off until 2 p.m so hey let's get to this money baby let's go Right, just pulling up to my first stop, y'all. Amazon location in Baltimore, B Mall. My city. Yeah, so I'ma pull up and um at this location the Lord the camera gonna read my license plate. So I don't know if y'all can see, but on the uh screen there it's telling me where to pick up my pickup from. Dock door 211. So, and then if you look on my phone, Dock door 211. So that's why I'm picking up. And Dock door 211 is literally right here. So that's why I'm picking up. And then that's what you want to do. So on the ground, that's say 211. But then also, look at the trailer number. It ends in 3303. On my phone, that should match up. So if you see, yeah. So it lets you know the trailer number you picking up as well as the spot you picking up. And that's important, y'all, because sometimes, bro, sometimes they would give you the spot number and uh, it's a different trailer in that spot. And your trailer might be in a spot next to it or something. So that's why it's always important. Make sure you match up them trailer numbers too, man. So let's get it. Line it up with your trailer. I'm going to have to put the phone down, though, once I... Fully back up. Guys, and always do a tug test. Once you connect to your trailer, please do a tug test, bro, because I done seen it. Um, I done seen somebody drop. I've I seen somebody drop the trailer two times because they ain't do a tug test. And um, that locking jaw wasn't all the way around that foot. Kingpin. So, yeah, definitely make sure you um, do a tug test. So, I'm connected to my trailer now. Now, I'm going to get out. Connect all my airlines and stuff. Raise my landing gear, then I'm gone. So connected to this trailer. Yo, to be honest, it ain't. It's not that cold tonight, man. It's not. It's a little warmer than I expected. Important. Once you connect the airlines and everything to the glad hands and grommets, your light, your trailer light should come right on. So. Make sure that's very important. Make sure all of this is pushed all the way in. This should be pushed all the way in. And your trailer lights will come on. So if if everything pushed in and your trailer not, lights not on, you got a small problem. So once you push everything in, your trailer lights should come on. Boom. So next, all I got to do is um raise my landing uh, legs and I'm out of here. Got these dope ass uh, mirrors, the mirror eyes on here. And 
connected to my trailer. Let's get out of here. Real simple, man. But so now I'ma just close my doors, make sure it's really empty. In that fast, y'all, I'm done my uh pickup at stop number one. So to the back of the trailer. Yeah, you always want to make sure you make sure you really got it empty, y'all. Uh. You don't want to get to your next stop with a load. So I'ma close these doors, then I'ma hit the road, y'all, and I'll be tapping back in What's with y'all. I hope y'all can hear me okay. So in the middle of my shift, y'all, um, literally, I just picked up my first stop. They just canceled like two of my stops and changed my whole stop so you know i told when we started this video i told you i'm starting in baltimore going to delaware new jersey new jersey back to baltimore or whatever man they didn't canceled and switched my whole stuff around so now i picked up in baltimore going to another stop in baltimore driving to new new jersey and then back to baltimore and then i'm done for the day it's going to be an easy ass day yeah, it happens like that sometimes, y'all. Sometimes they will cancel your loads and change your whole shit around. So, hey, let's get to it. All right, guys, this is stop number two. Um, so, like I said, they didn't since they canceled my load and switched everything up. I was supposed to go to Delaware. Now, I just literally drove like ten minutes away from my first stop. And then, uh, hold on, I'm gonna switch the camera yeah. around. So, like I was saying, man, since they didn't cancel my, so basically they canceled two of my loads, and so they switched this to a bobtail. So, basically, I don't need. I'm about to drop off. I don't gotta pick anything up. And my next stop is all. It's in New Jersey. So I'm, mind you, I'm already like an hour to now. I'm like an hour or two ahead of schedule now. This about to be a bobtail. I went from six stops down to five now. It's about to be an easy ass day for me. I ain't gonna hold you. I should be, I'm expecting to be off early today. Easy ass shift, man. So that's gonna happen sometimes, man. Sometimes you can, um, you know, you could pre-plan and pre-trip and, cause I like, I'm a, I'm a person who like to look at my loads and stuff beforehand and plan ahead. But then stuff like this can happen where they change your whole route around. So it is what it is, man. Um. Yes, ma'am. So how are we tonight? I'm good. Um, I'm dropping off and just bobtailing out. Uh, yes, sir. Can I get the last four of your right? Yep. 81F8. Alright. Okay. Let me check. So I'll be right back. Alright. No problem. Yeah, man. Yeah, sometimes you got to... Uh, All right, honey, you can take this to parking spot 589. 589. Five, five, yes, 589. 589. All right, thank you. Have a good night. Thank you. You're This one be a little busy, y'all. Uh. Are you pulling in? show y'all how it um yeah man so this side is when you when you at these warehouses and you try and park you got some space and then you're gonna have traffic and truck drivers like myself waiting for you to park so that pressure gonna be on you like especially when you first start that pressure gonna be on you because you're gonna feel like everybody waiting <laughs> watching you uh trying to back up man and squeeze it in look how look how he did it though look how he did it Look, and then you got somebody on the other side of him waiting. Then you got me on this side waiting. But all in all, man, take your time, man. Don't worry about these drivers, man. Take your time and get that bad boy in like they just did. I'm about to get it in, too. Right, guys, so here go my number, 589. So this way I need to park it. This is going to be easy because I got extra. I got a lot of space right here. So normally what I do, y'all, what I do is I normally... I line up to where my number is that I need to park at, right? 589. So I'm gonna go past it a little bit, y'all. Go past it a little bit. And 
then I'm gonna start my maneuver swapping. How easy I do it though, I'm lining up, I'm gonna whip it. I'm doing this with one hand by the way. I couldn't really record like how I wanted to because I, I, it's hard to try to record with one hand and park this mall but i got it in here no issues it took i ain't gonna lie it took me when i first started bro it took me like a good two to three weeks to get nice to just park this bad boy like that so i was struggling my advice to y'all man don't listen don't rush take your time like i don't care how many truck drivers waiting for you to park bro take your time that's what i had to get used to because i used to be like real nervous because i used to feel like everybody was looking at me and waiting for me to park man take your time they be all right we used to be where you where you at now i used to be one of the ones struggling to park so it is what it is man all right guys i'm out. i'm checking out then i'm hitting the road to new jersey y'all so that's where we at it's now 1 12 a.m i'm way ahead of schedule Oof. ready to be an easy night y'all just want to show y'all i'm so ahead of schedule now because of the, the cancel um lows and everything look it's it's 1 14 a.m i'm not even supposed to get here <laughs> they say i'm supposed to be there at 6 40. man i'm about to get there so early bro my departure time not until 9 15. i guarantee y'all i get i'm about to get there so early that i won't be able to check in and that's when i'm gonna be able to just get some sleep and relax so that's what i could this what i tell y'all man this is Hey, it's gonna be times y'all working with. It's gonna be, it's not going. Stuff can change. Stuff can get canceled. So I originally was supposed to keep them. My two, I was supposed to stop at Delaware, and I was supposed to have a stop before this. They canceled them two stops, and now they added the Baltimore stop where I'm at now, where I'm leaving from, and now they got me going straight here. So I'm gonna get there super early. Hey. I just wanted to show y'all, man, how, how stuff will play out sometimes. So. All right, let me hit this road, man. Uh, what's up, y'all? Excuse me yawning, man. So, as y'all can see, it's 3.40 a.m. Told y'all I was going to get here super early. I'm not supposed to get here until 6.40. Just arrived out New Jersey. Um, I know it's not... Listen, I'm about 99% certain they're not going to let me check in. They're going to be like, I'm way too early. But the only reason I'm about to still try to check in is because in this area, bro, it's nowhere for me to, like, park or pull to the side. So I'm hoping that, I don't know, I'm going to take my chance and see if maybe they let me they let me come in and um, park and chill and stuff because I don't have nowhere to park, like, I have to uh I have to try to find somewhere to go if they don't let me check in. But I, I'm telling you, they not gonna let me check in, bro. It's, I'm way too early. I'm like, I'm hella early. But it don't hurt the edge. Cause sometimes uh like I come to check in early and shit. You never know. Like it might be a load that's uh like already in a park and slip ready for me where the shit that shit might be ready. So I was like it don't hurt. I'm gonna try to check in and see if it worked or not. So I'll keep y'all posted. Uh, yeah, man. <laughs> I told y'all I was too early, man. They told me to drive down here to this gas station and I got a, uh, cause I'm like, there's nowhere to park. So they told me to come down here and park at this gas station, which is only like a three minute drive. So ready to park down here. So as you, I see it's hella trucks back here. So. Guess I'ma just find me a spot. Try to find me a spot somewhere. So, all right. So that's where we get minute with it, man. So, yeah, basically I I got there way too early. Um, I already knew they wasn't gonna let me check in. Dude ain't even. Uh, he they came out and talked to me like, bro, I ain't you way too early. Which I already knew. I just was like, I'ma try check in because I ain't see nowhere to park. So they sent me down here to this gas station area. I'm about to go to sleep, y'all. I ain't gonna hold you. So I'm, I think I'm ready to go ahead and cut this vlog, man. And um, cause from here, literally, once I go to, once I go back there, once it's my check-in time, I'm literally just gonna pick up my uh, I'm just gonna pick up 
And then I'm done holding my bed, y'all. It was distracting me because I seen this truck coming out. Um, I wanted to make sure they had enough space to get by. Yeah, man. So basically, after this, literally, I'ma just go back up there, pick up the uh, pick up the load, drive back to Baltimore. Then I'm done. So I'm, I'm I might go ahead and end the uh, vlog here. So yeah, man. All my new Amazon truck drivers, all my truck drivers, you definitely gonna have times where shit your, your lows might get canceled man like it was for me so this was literally an easy shift for me bro literally all i did was pick up a tr uh, empty drop that off to somewhere else in baltimore bobtailed all the way here to new jersey i'm about to pick this up drive back to baltimore with it drop it off and then they got me bobtailing from there so literally <laughs> easy ass shift today easy money i should get off hella early today and i'm gonna still get paid i'm gonna get paid for 12 hours up to 12 hours so um yeah man so that's just how it is man when you trucking stuff could get canceled stuff can happen but you know long as the money's still rolling in man make sure y'all like comment and subscribe um follow me on instagram at tate wilson 410 i got a lot of new videos on the way i'm about to go to sleep Look, I got my pillow, got my pillow and stuff, so I'm ready to lay back. Um, you know, yeah, man. God bless. I'm out.